So would you like to connect the Google Search Console directly into your Wix account? I'm going to be showing you how to do this in a very easy way. The very first thing you want to do is to set up your Google Search Console. So first, you need an actual Google Search Console account. If you don't have one, let's go into search.google.com and inside here, let's go for start now. Inside start now is going to be asking you to create an actual new website. So in this case, I have this website domain property. So I'm going to add a new one so you can see what's the process of how we can do this in a very easy way. So you can see that we have the domain and the URL prefix. In this case, what I need to do is to add my website to my Google Search Console. Inside here, I hit into add property. And you can see that we needed to add an actual site. So to enter the full URL of my website, I'm going to go into Wix. I'm going to choose my actual site. So view live site. And this is my actual site. So I copy it. I go back into Google Search and I paste it. Now I need to make sure that we don't have a subdomain. So I just delete it and I hit now to continue. Lastly, you want to make sure, of course, that you don't have the HTTP added. So I just select the very first part and I delete this protocol in the past. Now let's get into continue. Now the property should be verified in no time. Now, as you can see, we need to verify our site. So to verify this site, what we need to do is to make sure that we have the record type txt recommended so what i need to do is to copy and paste these read and add records directly inside my uh, website that i have just created the custom url so to add the html tag directly into my website we needed to go directly inside wix once again but we are inside our actual uh, site dashboard so i choose selected and here i wanted to focus into the section that says settings inside settings as you can see i click into left handed menu and i scroll down and clicked onto ceo section if you don't see it in here what you can do is to focus here into the upper side go here into the search bar and go for ceo now on the site verification you can see that we can choose go to site verification so click into this option and here, what you can do is to choose Google Search Console and paste the site verification tag. So this is the site verification tag. I copy it. Make sure that this one appears as a TXT file. So I go for save. Now, if it doesn't appear as it should be appearing, what you can do is to make sure that I choose the option that says verify. But now this time I use URL prefix and I go for continue. Now the verification should be checked it automatically because now we do have this new details added. So I can upload the HTML file to my website or choose only a text. So this tag, I copy it now and I paste it into the site verification center and I go for safe. Now uh, the verification meta tag into your site has not been added correctly. Let's go back directly inside the search Google console and go for verify. Now, sometimes this actually don't work because we needed to take some time to make the ownership verification. But in this case, actually it took just a few seconds. So if this one actually don't work for you, just try to wait a couple of minutes and try this again. Now what you can do is to go into done and your website should be created in no time. Now we can complete the verification into the Google Search Console. Make sure that here we have this URL section and Google will check for the HTML tag directly and the process might take a few seconds once again so you can now submit to the site map. So to help Google better understand your site structure, you can submit your site map inside Google Search Console dashboard. You can focus into sitemaps and here under indexed, you can just get started and of course enter your sitemap URL. So typically it could be, let's say for example, the triple W, the domain, the sitemap, XML. And of course, hit now into submit. And lastly, what you can do is to monitor your site performance. So with your site connected to the Google Search Console, you can start monitoring its performance directly into the dashboard. You will find various reports and tools that can help you to check out the potential issues and regularly check the response to understand how the site performance and identity opportunities for different improvements. With all this information, you can use the Google Search Console to address any issues for fixed broken links for any missing pages 
So if certain pages are indexed, you can ensure that they are not blocked by robots, you have proper internal linking, and of course, optimize your content, guys. Really important to optimize your content for better results and best ability using relevant keywords and improving page load times and all of those. So with all of that being said, that's how you can connect your Wix website to Google Search Console. So this powerful tool might help you to monitor your site performance and optimize it for better search best ability. So guys, with that being said, come up to the very end of the video. But don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools here directly inside the Text Express. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, we can all see you next time.